and gentlemen of the Gallery Gourmet. My name is Willy Wonka. For more than 50 years, the story of Willy Wonka and his chocolate factory has captured our imaginations. Come with me and you'll be in a world of pure imagination. Conjuring up a magical experience, chock full of candy and chocolate rivers. You know, no other factory in the world mixes its chocolate by waterfall. But it's the only way if you want it just right. Those are the images parents had in mind when they took their families to the Willy Wonka experience in Scotland. The advertisement spoke of cascading chocolate fountains and giant mushrooms filled with sweets. But instead, they got this. So you get nothing! A nearly empty warehouse. We got in, there was maybe 20 chairs, something like that. A few tables, a half-inflated bouncy castle. A sad-looking Oompa Loompa standing next to a half-finished science project. And we were all just kind of looking at each other and, and just in disbelief, really. One parent telling ABC his kids were given a jelly bean and a half cup of limeade. No chocolate to be found. And my little girl, she's only four. She was dressed up and as Willy Wonka and everything, so she was really looking forward to it, and she was quite disappointed. Even Paul Connell, the man hired to play Wonka, says he was duped. I was very excited, and then I, I received the script. The reaction to the event itself, understandably, people are outraged. Kids were really let down, and you're like, that's, that's not okay. The event organizer, House of Illuminati, which advertises extraordinary events and immersive experiences, instead shutting down the event midday.